Qantas auto services market is now worth 50 billion yuan, galloping ahead at 40 percent per year. We speak to Olaf Gasler and CEO of BMW Brilliance about the automaker's one-stop shop service model. In today's Auto Show Profile, I speak to Olaf Kastner, the CEO of BMW Brilliance China, about how they're using the leasing option to get people on board their new e-car. Why the rental model for the Zenora? The rental model for us is a very strategic element. This is a new technology. We strongly believe that people have to get used to this new technology. Instead of spending a lot of money up front and then starting to experience the technology, we wanted to bring the car closer to make it more affordable. And when you see that the daily rental costs 400 renminbi, it is very affordable. You save on fuel. For the fun, you save fuel and it's very affordable and fun to drive this car. How much take up are you expecting for the first year? We are not really thinking in volume. We, we have our internal planning, but um, in that respect, this is not a technology where you talk about volume right away. It's an investment from us. A lot of manufacturers here show their cars. We have all invested. We are now looking together to build up the infrastructure and uh, charging stations. And in that respect, more and more customers will experience that. And with that, demand will come and volume will come. Tell us about what services you offer, because um, you know we know there are like second-hand BMW um, dealerships. There are, um, you know, you have the rentals with the Zenora, um, and because it's a 50 billion yuan market that's growing at 40 percent a year, you know, it's a it's a great opportunity. We have developed almost a full circle you need in a developed car market. Of course, it started with new car sales for a year, very buoyant. Now, and no wonder, we always expected that the growth rates are still magnificent, but they are coming down slightly. The dealers in that time have developed after sales because just selling the car is not enough for customer orientation for a premium brand. We will this year run about 250,000 training days to train our service network. We have the largest service network out there. We have more than 420 dealer outlets and we are growing that as well, predominantly in future in the smaller tier towns. So we are talking not only third tier, we are talking a fourth and fifth, but at the same time we are consolidating services, creating more work base in first and second tier. And car financing? Is that car financing, yes. We have a um, finance company uh, on the ground with a very successful penetration rate of 30%. So they grew very quickly. Uh, we have uh, the used car development. We are the leaders in the market in, in used cars. So you see quite a lot. We have fleet business developing and this will stronger develop in the future. The market is ready for it. We will see in the future, I think, more leasing in the market. Uh, known very well from the West, not that well known here. So this is the full circle, I always say, of success of a car manufacturer in the country.